I'm Lauren Logan and I'm a curator at the Scottish National Gallery of Modern Art. This is La Boisse en Valise, or Box in a Suitcase, from 1935-41 to by Marcel Duchamp, which was presented to the Scottish National Gallery of Modern Art by Gabrielle Keeler in 1989. Marcel Duchamp is considered to be the father of conceptual art and one of the most important artists of the 20th century. Born in France in 1887, Duchamp was intrigued by the ideas that ordinary mass-produced things could be considered as art objects in their own right. He preferred simply to sign and sometimes alter household objects, calling them ready-mades. The artwork sits on a specifically constructed plinth and is displayed with a protective perspex lid. 24 deluxe versions of the case were made, each featuring a different hand-coloured original fixed to the inside of the case's lid. This version of the box is number two in the edition and it is dated May 1941. It is dedicated to the poet and bookbinder Georges Unier, who helped in the manufacture of the work. The interior of the case is constructed of card and wood with brass clips and braces in place to secure the construction. The upright section contains two wings which are carefully slid out on wooden tracks. The first wing on the right has a protective polyester sleeve which protects the artwork from abrasion when opening and closing. Once the wing has been fully extended, it is steadied on a brass clip. The left wing is similarly slid out, this time with a further hinge section and again a brass clip is provided to steady the artwork. The main compartment within the case is then opened to reveal the remaining printed artworks on paper which are arranged around the display case. The leather case is unclipped and carefully opened, revealing the original artwork within the case. In this case, the original is a small celluloid version of Duchamp's masterpiece, The Bride's Gypped Bear by her bachelor's even, also known as The Large Glass, which she made between 1915 and 23. A second celluloid version of the work stands upright in the centre of the boîte, flanked by the three miniature replicas of Duchamp's ready-mades, Fountain at the bottom, Plan de Voyage, which is the typewriter cover in the centre, and Air de Paris, which is the glass ampoule of Paris Air at the top. The leather case contains 69 reproductions of paintings and objects made by Duchamp from 1910 onwards, including tiny facsimiles of his three-dimensional works, some of which swivel out on hinges and brackets. Duchamp worked from 1935 to 1940 in Paris, collecting the material for his portable museum, assembling photographs, supervising the meticulous colour reproduction of his works and procuring the miniature replicas of his ready-mades. 